In motocross, the scrubbers became a game changer. A lot of people can teach you how to scrub, but there's only one person can teach you how to bubble scrub. The Bubba Scrub was born out of pure necessity and my desire to win. A true Bubba Scrub happens when you have the perfect mix between speed and commitment. For me, I try to choose uh, rolling jumps or triple faces. If there's bumps up to it, I'll pre-hop it, and then once the both wheels come off the ground, I'll actually lean towards the ground. Or if there's no bumps into it, it slide both wheels off the face of it. Right now, both wheels are off the ground. The bike is leaned over. At this point, you know, I'm just kind of leaning with the motorcycle, trying to keep my head upright so I can still, you know, focus and concentrate. As I'm starting to lean forward, I'm starting to pull the bike back up so I can straighten it up. Because obviously when you do a bubble scrub, you're only a few inches off the ground, so you don't have a lot of time to be able to stand the bike up. I usually try to turn my front wheels down. If you left it up, you wouldn't be able to lean the bike over. You would actually start losing the resistance of the bike. Because there is a point where the bike is free. You're almost just kind of waiting for the bike to try to straighten itself back up. So if it doesn't, then you have to land wide open on the gas and almost pull it back out. To be honest with you, I hate doing the bubble scrub. The gnarly bubble scrubs are when you're doing it really low is when you're trying to pass somebody and those are dangerous. I invented the move. I don't do it a lot because when I do do it, I make it count. 